guys and welcome back to my channel. On a Thursday afternoon in 2016, Shannon Sharp went in for a routine screening that will later reveal the NFL Hall of Famer's prostate cancer diagnosis. Now the 54-year-old athlete is cancer-free and ready to share his story to raise awareness around prostate cancer. Once you hear that C word come out of their mouth, okay damn, he calls Sharp, who was diagnosed just one month before he was scheduled to relocate to Los Angeles, where he had just landed a co-hosting gig on FS1 alongside Skip Bayless. It was difficult. This was my dream job, he tells people. I had been wanting this job for so long, and I had been given an opportunity that Skip believed in me. I was going to be a co-host of a daily debate show that we talked about football, basketball, track and field, golf, tennis, Social issues, I was the first athlete to do what I do full-time. Sharp and Bela 70 co-host FS1's daily show Undisputed, Skip and Shannon were the analysts discuss current happenings across the sports world. I didn't want this opportunity to go away because I wanted to show that athletes could do more than talk about their past sports. I felt there were a lot of people counting on me to be able to go fulfill this obligation that I have been given. Sharp reveals, only four people knew at the time, my brother and sister and my girlfriend at the time. I didn't tell my mom, I didn't tell my kids, I didn't tell anybody. The father of three, who didn't want to worry his family, says it was at least a year before he felt comfortable enough to tell them. The last thing I need you to do is worry about something that you cannot control. You worrying is going to make me worry and that wasn't going to help our situation, he explains. They did after a while, I think they understood that dad is strong, dad can do it, dad does a great job of compartmentalizing. And the thing was, I found out I had just got the job at Undisputed. Sharp had been getting screened for prostate cancer since he retired from the league in 2003, mainly because of his family's history. My dad died at 39 and other brother, he died in his mid 40s and the other died in his late 40s, early 50s. So all that's going through my mind, so absolutely, I'm getting checked out all the time. But Chop says, everything felt fine. When he went in for the screening, I felt fine. I was exercising, eating right, drinking plenty of water, no really bad habits or anything. I thought it was going to be routine. Says Sharp, I fractured my eye socket, broken my collarbone, dislocated my elbow, I tore, I tore a rib cartilage, separated both of my shoulders. Those are the things you can feel. I felt normal. There was no transformation in my body. I didn't lose weight. There was no pain, no nothing. And if you had just looked at me, I looked like the picture of hell. The scariest realization for the three-time Super Bowl champion, however, was the possibility of missing out on future generations of his family, like his own father and uncles had. Like I said, my dad died at 39. He had another brother that died in his mid-40s, another brother died in his late early 50s. Now that he's looking forward to spending time with his grandson, Sharp says, at the end of the day, really all I have now is my health. It's the most important commodity that I possess. I hope you enjoyed watching this video, like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.